Hi everyone, it's Melissa with This Alive. I'm here with a Dollar Tree haul. Um, if I cough or sound funny, I have pneumonia right now. I'm on two different antibiotics, nebulizer and inhaler. Um, I can't take steroids because they make me super paranoid. And it's just bad. But they gave me multiple IVs of antibiotics and fluids and stuff in the ER so um, I am feeling a little bit better of course not a hundred percent but I wanted to show you a little Dollar Tree haul GCAT brought things out of the car um, this isn't everything and it's unfortunate because I had some things in there that I really wanted to show you guys but um, we're gonna get into it I, get, I found some good things still. There's some good things in here. Um, <clears throat> there's other things in the car that I really want to show you guys, though. First thing is a $3.25 item, which is odd. But it's this vanilla papaya natural breeze scented oil warmer and refill. And the little scent thing smells really nice. So I, I did pick that up. I love these type of things right now. I'm not using anything. It's It smells so good. Um, I'm not using anything right now in the house because Salem has had real bad um, asthma attacks last couple nights. Um, so I'm thinking I'm going to have to take her to the vet. Here's Cobweb. He's Mr. Busy tonight. He's been playing. Um, <laughs> but I think I'm going to have to take her to the vet and probably get her on oral steroids because she doesn't seem to be paranoid. I mean, I have no idea how she feels, but I'd uh, rather save her life than... She hates her inhaler, though, I can tell you that. I think the rest of the... No, I do have a couple other... Uh, plus section items. G Cat loved these stockings. So I picked up one in the gray and one in the green. And I believe there's a red one. So I'm looking for that one so that we can each have one of these really nice plush stockings. And I think at Walmart, these would probably run you about eight, nine dollars. So you know, $3 for this, I think, is a good deal. So we've got green and gray so far. If nothing else, I, uh, the gray seems to be in there a lot. And the back is kind of a suede felt. You know, not the real cheap felt that they have on their $1.25 stockings. But uh, gray seems to be there a lot. So if nothing else, I'll pick up another gray one if I can't find a red one. <clears throat> Excuse me. A um, couple boring things. I picked up about four of these Old Orchard tomato juice. I love these. They're 100% juice. Um, there's like no added sugars. Or at least I don't think so. Sugars, it looks to be six grams. It's hard for me to see. I get my new glasses this weekend if the man can take me and I feel good enough to take the trip. I, I think I think I should be able to get my glasses. Um that this this prescription is not working out very well for me. I got uh three packs of this three pouch beef eaters chicken and tuna chunk and gravy. Appetizer for cats. They like these. And uh, the cats are getting them quite expensive. Especially with Salem. And I got to take the kitten to the vet. Um, it's just, uh, it's a lot. There's a lot going on in my life at the moment. Um, financially, physically, mentally. So it's, it's uh, been kind of raw. I do have a thing where you can buy me a coffee on my community page. Um, I said before, I would, I would use it to buy the cats treats. 
if you would like to do that buy the cat some treats if not of course you know there is no no expectations we got these pecan twirls sweet rolls they're good that we've already been in them I had one G cat had um, looks like he had a couple <laughs> the man had one I think so there's that they're good another kind of boring item is we got this McTrader ramen noodle sirloin we've been eating a lot of ramen lately I don't know why and actually my uh, my ramen is over here I want to show you if it's not pink I won't eat it can you see how much hot sauce is in that probably not because it's settled and soaked it up but usually my ramen is like super pink I mean if not flat out red because I love Frank's hot sauce and well <laughs> in my ramen I got a couple packages of these little Slurpees from Friskies. I am not sure if this is a good deal because I only seen it in um, like multi packs, so I don't know. But I think I got, I think I got three of them. So I'm sure that the girls and boy now will love those. Uh, what should I show you next? I got, since I haven't been feeling good, I got these Scotty's Triple Soft Aloe. Three layers of softness, 54 tissues. In my little box like that. I'll see if they're soft. Because you know when you're sick, blowing your nose a lot, you don't want something that's going to tear up your face. They seem to be soft. The test is definitely using them over time so we will see I've never used those before I don't I don't think next I thought this was beautiful I think they had also red and green but this like mercury glass so pretty and I meant to have a candle in there but I'll show you the next thing that I got it's not really going to go down then and there, but you can kind of maybe get an idea of how it'll look. So pretty. And then the next item, where's the, I got this, the LED snowflake light. I was excited about these, so I picked up two. Here's in the package, and here is out and lit up. Look how pretty that is. I mean, I love that. Isn't that just gorgeous? I was excited for these. So they were actually a wish list item. Then I got um, four of these satin pillowcases. And I actually felt it in the store because you can feel it open and kind of stick your finger in there. And these feel better than what they've brought us in a while. The last really good ones were the pink ones that they brought out, I think around Valentine's Day. Those were really good, but these are nice too. These are like, I don't know why I'm holding it like that, but they are the Satin Pillowcase by Home Collection. And like I said, most of their Satin Pillowcases, they're real rough, not nice. These are very nice. I've got one right here that I went ahead and stuck on the pillow. It is a nice smooth, like your hair will glide on that. It is nice and soft for your skin and hair. Ooh, I want to show you real quick. This is one of the things the man got me for my birthday. My uh, quilt set, it came with two pillowcases. So that's what my quilt looks like. It's a king size quilt and then two king sized pillowcases. Aren't they awesome? So they're back here. But this is a very nice, if you see this cream satin pillowcase, I got four. So there is that. 
I got two of the um the pillowcase holiday pillowcases. This one says candy canes, cookies, cocoa, and confections. And uh, I ordered from Walmart inserts to put in these and they were too big so I got to take them back and get the right size or you know I might actually just get some of my um throws and fold them up and put them in here you can also stuff them with bags whatever you have you know just depending on what you want I uh, got this one too which here it is in the packaging so you know what you're looking for. It's the pillowcase and it's by Christmas House. There are $1.25. So I got this design. They had, I think, like two Christmas tree designs too, but these were the ones that I really liked. I love gingerbread. The smell of it, the taste of it, and little gingerbread men and women so I got this one try to see what you're seeing it says baked fresh daily gingerbread baking co cookies cakes pies and hot cocoa just these are such good quality actually too I really like these so I'm looking forward to uh, getting something Put in here and decorate with them. I had hauled this last time in a round one, but I took this out of the package because I picked up one of these craft decor chalk writers in the silver. Let me see. Anything? Oh, you can see what it says. Um, to remove chalk, use a damp cloth. That's what I was looking for, actually. Which I think I had bought some of these years ago, but I don't, I don't remember. I know they're a different consistency than a regular chalk, like piece of chalk. So I'm gonna see how this looks. Give me a moment. I'm gonna try to be neat. I thought the silver would show up really nice against the black, but maybe I should have got white. But my, and if you see the camera jumping, that is, uh, that is cobweb. So, I don't think the silver shows up as well as what I wanted it to, so. But I'm going to show you when I get my artful writing done. Oh, I guess I guess it's not so bad. What do you guys think? And I'm actually going to paint this. I don't like the cheap gold looking. So I think I'm going to either antique it or paint the outside. I wonder how easy it comes off. Let me grab that tissue. Mama spit takes care of everything. Okay. It it came right off of there. Nice. Okay. I'm uh I'm happy with the little chalkboard in the picture frame, the the chalk writer. I not so happy with my my writing tonight. And actually, you're supposed to either, you can set it on a table or hang it, but I like it this way. So I'm going to try to glue something back here to hang it that way. I told my friend that I would be at her birthday party with bells on. So for from Christmas house, I picked up red and silver bells. I'm also going to put one on um, Cobweb's collar. Because I, I couldn't find a kitten collar in Walmart. Got him a dog collar for tiny dogs. So you get 32 bells. 
I got the silver and the red. So I'm going to make a bracelet and wear those to my friend's birthday party. And then I'm going to put one on a cobweb's collar. I showed you the pillowcases. Like I said, I got four of those. They're so nice. I got some spoons to keep in here in my bedroom for my yogurt. I'm going to try to start eating better. I'm, uh, I'm eating really bad right now when I eat. And that was even before I got pneumonia. So I have been craving cigarettes and I don't know why. So I got some of these charms mini pops and I hadn't seen these before. You get 25 pops. They're tiny. But they had some really interesting flavors. There's watermelon, blue ras, bubblegum, cherry, grape, orange, strawberry, green apple, tropical fruit punch, banana. Banana is something you don't usually see. Cotton candy, orange cream, birthday cake, that's another one. Root beer float, apple pie, you don't see apple pie usually either, mango and limeade. So I thought that those, and I had a banana one, it wasn't bad. And I don't know why I'm all of a sudden craving cigarettes, I have no idea. I think just the financial, the health, um, all the other things that I'm dealing with right now. Is stressing me out so bad. I'm just looking for something, I guess. Um, I also got told by, um, uh, I've had, like, thickening of my heart walls or whatever for a while. I don't know if that's the medical term. Um, I found out recently that I have a leaky valve, which I, I, they said it wasn't that bad. So I'm like, okay, I'm not worried about that. But I had the test to see if I had pulmonary hypertension. Um, the heart doctor did not tell me I had pulmonary hypertension. But when I went to the actual lung doctor, he said, yeah, you do. It's not real bad, but um, I was like, why didn't the heart doctor tell me? I don't know. I don't understand what's going on, and there's just been a lot. So, I did find the Tushy Wipes for Women. Tushy Women Flushable Wipes. You get 48. There's aloe vera and vitamin E. And I just love this packaging, and that there's a little door on here. So, I picked up two of those. Uh, and of course, I'm sure I put them in the bathroom. The the guys will use them too. We like wet wipes in this household. Helps keep our bums clean. <laughs> oh my goodness. Um, I I don't know. Oh wow. These are I ripped one getting it out, but they're pretty thick. I mean, you can't really do that. They will rip. Because um, they smell really nice. They actually have a super nice scent. Um, because they're flushable, you know they're gonna they're gonna tear up like that. But I would not put them down my toilet. I always tell Gcat, do not do not flush things like this, even if it says just don't. <clears throat> I did find one of these Axe Dark Temptation Dark Chocolate Air Fresheners, and these are great, and I figured out how to use them because before I couldn't see the tiny little instructions that you get, but it's easy. I just figured it out. You open them up. That's how you adjust like how much of it you want to I guess release into the air you know how much smell you want to smell take that off this smells so good and 
if that whole thing is filled up, that's that's going to last quite a while. I love that smell. And you just put that back on there. And like I said, you adjust, adjust it up to how much you want to smell of it. Oh, I think these are awesome. It smells, oh, I didn't have it clicked in there, but these smell so good. So good. So if you see those for $1.25, just dropped it. Sorry. If you see those for $1.25, definitely pick them up. I think they smell amazing. Something else I thought smelled really good was these Luminescence Winter Magic Six Scented Tea Candles. And I think they have these same fragrances. There's three different fragrances. They all smell pretty good, but I thought these would give the best throw. And I think they have these same fragrances in these nice little gift boxes. But I wanted the tea lights for this little um, lantern. But that smells so good. It smells Christmassy to me. Winter magic. So I got six of those. I picked up Maleficent. I hadn't seen the fuzzy socks and the Maleficent. So I had to grab those. These are really soft. I love soft socks. And actually the baby socks that like that they have out, I don't think they're Snuggadoo. I think they're Disney. Those are the softest one in the Dollar Tree. And I'm like, oh, I wish they weren't just baby and toddler socks because I would get them. These are nice. I don't know if they're going to fit because their size is 9 to 13. And I wear a size 7 in women's. But I couldn't resist because Maleficent's my favorite. G-Cat loves these. Um, I went ahead and got some for him to have now. And then he has some for his stocking. He likes to suck on them till they make a point. He's a boy. You know. <laughs> I picked up more of these little magnetic bookmarks. There's six pieces. These are just a nice thing, I think, to tuck in like a present. You know, if you've got a gift bag or even maybe to put on your bow on your Christmas package. They say, God is love. I something hope. Um, grace. Rejoice always, hope. I think there's some with um, like actual Bible verses, but I can't read it. It's too small right now. Hopefully when I get my new glasses, I can see better. I wanted these. These were a wish list item too. They're the claws and uh, dog toys. I thought they were cat toys because they're awfully small. But there is a squeaker in there and they are dog toys but I was going to rip them apart and sew catnip in them but and I've done that before with like the the soft candy bars that they had I did that I put catnip in them and took the squeaker out I think with these I'm just going to spray them down real good with catnip spray and see if the cats will play with them like that. Um, last thing in this one. There's still a bunch of stuff out in the car. I think I have seen this before, but it really caught my eye. It's the Camel Milk Moroccan Clay and Cinnamon. And I think it's Bidu. Is the brand Triple Milled Face and Body Bar Detox and Balance. And it's a four ounce. And of course it tells about it on the back. But I can't read it. Because it's way too small. This smells really good. There was another one they brought out. I, I couldn't stand the smell of it. But this. This camel milk. Moroccan clay and cinnamon. Smells really good. So I thought I'd give that a try. 
And that is the end of this haul. Um, I'm already wearing my little Christmas outfit from Walmart. I have Walmart. I have more Dollar Tree. I have um, some Amazon that I might show. I might not. Um, lots of Timu. But I'm going to get off here. If you guys want to buy the cats some cat treats, um, there's a buy me, buy me a coffee link. I might go ahead and put it on this video um, down in the comments so that you guys can find it. If not, you know, but no pressure. I don't expect anything. But if you'd like to, you're welcome to do that. I'm going to get off here. I'm, I think, I don't know, I feel real restless, but I'm, I'm tired and I don't feel good at the same time. And, um, I, Marina, I talked to her about it and the man, they're both thinking it's the meds and me just being really sick. <clears throat> and I can, I can hear myself wheezing. I don't know if you guys can. Hopefully not, because don't want to come out on, you know, do the heavy breathing thing on video. <laughs> but anyway, I, we're going to get off here. It's been, uh, it's been longer than I thought this was going to be. So until I see you guys again, take care of yourselves, take care of each other, and always, mm, much love. Bye.